welcome back everyone to Baz's 12 Beers of Christmas. There we go. Make the most of this fine looking jumper because for the 12 days of Christmas, this will be the last time you see it. So, Baz's 12 Beers of Christmas, day nine, what have we got coming up? We've got one that I picked up from uh, Morrison's and it's from Northern Monk. And this is a can of their Festive Star, which is a vanilla and cinnamon chocolate porter coming in at 5.2%. 330 ml can and this was two pound two pounds so uh i think it's a a, a twist on one of the other ones they've done anyway uh so yeah obviously this is their festive edition great artwork as usual a little bit of holly and a bits on it and what have you so let's get it out the can get it into the beard and ol that if you can see that a festive glass for this festive stout so uh well, poor. So let's, let's get it out of the can, crack on with this video. Hope you're all good. We've had a little bit of an explosion there. Must have overfilled it just to be generous. Again, I, I think I've seen one or two videos for this. Don't really remember anything about it. I don't think the beer's been too bad, but maybe not as good as as what some people were hoping. So I ain't gonna get it all in there, I don't think. No, I ain't gonna get it all in there, got a bit carried away. So, beer in a glass. No light getting through that. Jet black. Uh, a little bit of carbonation coming up the side of the glass. We got a finger and a half of really creamy, compact tan head. Looks really good. So let's try and dive in with the nose and uh, pour some aromas on it. Vanilla, yeah, definitely get the vanilla there. And the cinnamon for me. Definitely pick that sort of that, bit. the vanilla's there, slightly sweet, and you're getting that slight sweet but warm sort of aroma from the cinnamon. Getting a bit of chocolate as well. Getting everything what it says on the can, that's for sure. It smells really nice, it's got a little sweet edge to it. Smells really decent, so uh, let's dive in. Cheers, everyone. Five point two percent. Body's probably as you would expect, really, for something that sort of strength. very little sort of carbonation. It is there, but it's very gentle. Mouth feels okay. Nice enough, I suppose. Hmm. Yeah, mouth feels nice enough there. Uh, the biggest thing that really sort of hit you, I would say, or certainly for me, really pick up that cinnamon in there straight away. Vanilla is in there, but it's more in the background. You're getting a roasty, roasty bitterness in there. Yeah, you, you're getting that cinnamon and that roasty bitterness all at the same time. Sort of in the background for me, I'm picking up that vanilla with that sort of like chocolatey sort of sweetness, chocolate taste in there. Ah, what do I think of it? I mean, the beer does exactly what it says. But myself, I'm 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 not over keen on it. Uh, you know, which is quite odd because I do like a sweeter drink, especially a, a, a sweeter dark drink. Then if just for me, I'm finding that cinnamon, maybe just a tad overpowering in there for me but uh i mean it does what it says so you can't argue with that it is festive the fact that you're getting the cinnamon you are getting the vanilla obviously you're getting that little bit of chocolate in there as well you know it is doing what it says on the tin so uh so yeah as i say it does what it says on the tin so for me yeah it does the job 
but I find the cinnamon a little bit too overpowering. So, uh, so yeah, they're my views on it. If you've had this beer before, let me know what you think. Feel free to comment. Two pound, it's worth a dabble. Go to Morrison's, give it a go. You might like it, you might not. Uh, quickly, 5.2%, is it drinking like that? Yeah, it's drinking about that. There's no real sort of big alcohol taste in there, really. It's just it's just drinking sort of pretty much like it. And it's got the, it's got the sort of taste of like Christmas chocolates or something, I would say. So, uh, so yeah, like I said, I'm going to shut the hell up. Go and give it a try if you want to. If you've had it before, let me know what you think. And thank you all for subscribing. So I'll see you again on another beer review. Cheers.